What's going on everyone? Welcome to Path to Wellness. Today's video is how to have a six pack 365 days a year. So if you're not yet subscribed to the channel, go ahead and click the subscribe button and check the bell so you're notified of all my new videos. And I do appreciate that. So real quick before I get started, I wanted to mention that I'm now doing fat loss and wellness coaching. So if you're interested in some extra help, go ahead and send me an email or you could message me on Facebook or Instagram, and those links are in the description box below. And also, I, uh, my son started a YouTube channel. He plays the piano, he's only 10 years old. So go ahead and show him some support if you wanna hear some nice piano music, and subscribe to his channel. I got the link in the description box as well. All right, so I was just, uh, came down here to Northern California to visit some family where I used to live, and wanted to put together this video. Oh, we got a bunch of turkeys coming up here on the ground and uh, so this is a workout video plus what I ate after let's check out these turkeys real quick they're all right here a whole bunch of turkeys hey they made it they made it out of Thanksgiving alive anyway wow there's a whole bunch of them um, this is a workout video it's called I call this one the 253 and I'm going to show you some clips from the workout it's really simple it's 50 pull-ups 100 push-ups 100 squats and then a three mile run so it's full body it's everything you need to stay fit get in great shape and I'm going to show you some modifications as well so if you're new to you know exercising anyone can do this workout you need minimal equipment and then I'm going to show you what I ate after the workout as well so what I'd recommend what you eat to stay fit stay healthy and stay strong so here it is all right I call this workout the 253 and it's because it's 250 reps and then a three mile run so start out with pull-ups or some sort of a pull move and if you can't do regular pull-ups yet then you can use a pull-up assist band to help you out or if you're at the gym you can use a pull-up assisted machine to get you started. Then once you get strong enough, you'll be able to do regular pull-ups on your own. So do several sets until you can get to 50 pull-ups. And um, I'm gonna be doing different hand positions as well throughout the sets. That way I'm working slightly different muscle groups. So you can do overhand pull-ups, um, underhand pull-ups known as chin-ups, that's what I call them. So you're getting up, getting up 50 pull-ups. Now once you have your 50 pull-ups, go ahead and take a couple minutes rest and you can start on push-ups, and we're doing 100 push-ups. So however many you can do in a set, get to about 90% or so of failure. That's what I'm doing, then taking a little break and then continuing with the next set until I get to 100 push-ups. Now you can always do push-ups on your knees to modify, so if you can't do a lot of push-ups, start out with push-ups on your knees, and if you're really strong, you can put a weight on your back and do weighted push-ups. So I do those sometimes as well. Once the push-ups are done, you're doing 100 squats. Now, doing 100 squats without weights might be pretty easy for some people. So if you're, you know, if you're not new to exercising, I would say add a weight. I added a 50-pound weight to the squats. Do several sets and or however many until you can get to 100. Maybe some people can do those in one set. That would be pretty good. Um, but if you're, new to, if you're new and you want to modify, just don't use any weight. And you're going to do 100 squats going to about 90% of failure on each set, and then take a little break until you get to 100 squats. And that's the 250 reps. 50 pull, 100 push, 100 squats. Once you're done with the squats, go on that three mile jog, three mile run. Now here's what I had afterward. I made this smoothie, it's great after workout smoothie. I got ground flax seeds, I got a banana, I got a bowl of frozen fruit. It's berries and mangoes and peaches. I got some Marcus Roscrans Green Pro C Mix. That's all raw, very healthy. I got a couple big handfuls of greens and uh, some water to dilute that. That's a great smoothie. Try that out. Thanks for watching, everyone. Give a thumbs up if you liked the video, and we'll be back soon. All right, have a good day. Bye.